Rupert Brooke himself was a highly articulate, very handsome, very privileged, highly educated, very sensitive young man. He wasn't a battle-hardened war veteran reporting on what he actually had witnessed and his on-the-spot opinions of what warfare was actually like. He was a young man about to go to war and this is what he thought the experience would be like. And because Brooke never actually experienced warfare, this means the poem itself can be very polarising. On the one hand, we have the idea that what he says is actually rather insulting to the soldiers who are involved in the uh, actual realities of combat in that particular engagement. The guys actually fighting and dying in the trenches during the First World War. On the other hand, is the idea that what Brooke captures here is uh, the specific brand of patriotism that those joining the military are often inclined to.